So NZT net zero carbon, it's our ambition uh, to be carbon neutral by 2040 and to do that by the end of the lifetime of this strategic plan, which is 2025, we'll have reduced our carbon emissions by 24%. In the old strategy we used to have five themes, um, we did a lot of consultation with staff and students and agreed to add a sixth theme, uh, which is embracing sustainability, so that's where it fits uh, strategically. Well, we're a big organisation, 37,000 students, 4,500 staff, we've got five campuses, five sites. Um, so we're a big emitter, uh, so we've got to play our part uh, in reducing carbon emissions, not just ourselves, but working with our partners. Obviously we're looking at the emissions we produce ourselves, but unusually I think for a lot of organisations we're also committed to reducing our scope 3 emissions. Those are the emissions that are produced by others that we work with. So we're focusing very much on working with those that we purchase from uh, to reduce their emissions uh, and also uh, emissions connected with travel and transport. So this is a whole university endeavour uh, involving our academic colleagues, our students and our professional services staff. So we've talked about achieving our net zero carbon ambitions which is lar largely led by our professional services colleagues. We're also trying to embed sustainability in the curriculum led by our uh, teaching and learning colleagues and of course we do some great research into sustainability uh, led by our research colleagues so it is really a whole university endeavour. So we've got tons of information on the sustainability webpage uh, as well as information about what we're doing. We've got lots of resources there in terms of online training, face-to-face uh, -face training that you can take part in so I would encourage people to go to the sustainability webpage.